Hi Pink Villa, I'm Kiara Advani and I'm going to share with you my everyday go-to makeup tutorial. Um, it's super easy and um, yeah, let's go. So to start off, I use um, and I swear by this moisturizer. It's by Charlotte Tilbury. It's Charlotte's Magic Cream, which is super light and um, super easy to apply. I like putting a lot of it on my cheekbones, so it gives me that automatic highlighting effect. Um, yeah, but basically you put on your T-zone, I've already done that, so I'm not going to put too much of it. Um, then I, so I'm somebody who doesn't really use a lot of foundation or compact powder or anything like that, um, you know, when I'm not shooting. I prefer just using my MAC concealer. I always have this with me and always take it with me. And I just put it on all the parts of my face, on my skin that is slightly pigmented, like um, if I have dark circles. I just, you know, use my ring finger, but I, I just put a little bit of it under my, in my, on my under eyes. Um, if I have any zits or any, you know, um, unnecessary dark spots, then I just cover it up with that. And that's all I actually use. I don't use any foundation or, um, you know, studio fix powder or any of that when I'm not shooting. I just let the skin breathe and this is my only quick fix concealer then I love using blush on so I put a lot of blush on I carry two blush ons in my bag reason being because one has the brush with it and the other one doesn't um, but the NARS orga or orgasm blush on is amazing it's actually one of the best blush ons that I've ever used especially because it has um, the highlighting powder as well in it so it's all mixed together so it gives you that little shine so you just put it on the apples of your cheek so this is my and being a powder it's okay if you put a little extra because it is going to kind of you know get brushed away I think I put a little much right now but it's fine but it's, no one said you can't have too much blush okay now, you can either enhance your eyes or your lips. I'm a really lazy person when it comes to going back home and removing my makeup. So the reason why I'm telling you that I love putting bright pop colored lips is so that I don't have to go home and take off all that dark eye makeup. Also being summer, I think it's great to get a little bit of color, you know, on your face, um, in your attire and everything. So. That's the reason why I'm going to go for pop lips. As you can see here, I don't know if they're going to pan down, but I'll pick out a few of my favorite lip colors, which are great for the day. Um, they're all shades of pink. I love pink. And this one is by Marc Jacobs. It's like a little crayon, but it's a lovely, it's a lovely pink. It's, um, it's a little dry on applying because it's a matte finish, but it gives you long lasting quality so okay this is a trick my mom um, <laughs> told me she said always put your lipstick and then take out a little bit once and then put it again so you get that long last effect so there we go and to complete my look, so that you make your eyes to look big. Now I've already applied mascara, but I never leave home without mascara. I love mascara. I'm always like carrying uh, several mascaras <laughs> just in case. Um, so I'm currently using Benefits, their real lash mascara, which is super awesome. I'm going to still do another coat. I love this because it's it gives you um, a really nice thick, dark, um, you know coat over your lashes at the same time it's not clumpy which is great and I always put it even on my lower lash line a lot of people try to avoid that and just put it up but I think you should put it down because it opens out the eye completely so that's my super easy super simple everyday five minute um, yeah makeup routine that I just do and work out the house and I think it looks pretty cool it looks like you know there is something there because of the bright color, but everything else is really simple and really easy to do. Uh, for those who don't have evened out skin tone, uh, I would suggest 
the MAC Studio Fix Compact Powder because again you want to keep it easy and I think because of the weather and being super humid it's better to use something that's a little powdery rather than creamy so yeah that would be my suggestion to you but this is a really easy everyday makeup look um, now if you don't want to do lips like this if you want to keep it tinted which is another thing I really love doing I'm going to remove this I only remove my makeup with Johnson baby oil it's so easy it's so light on the face I'm going to remove my lips right now with this okay now instead of a really pop color you want to look a little more natural and not too in your face then of course you have many lip tints um, the benefit lip tint is really good but this is one of my most favorite lip tints it's I can't even pronounce the name of it it's called Chateau Labiote I have no idea it's too fancy for life but it is amazing it comes in these really cute wine they're called wine lip tints and they come in these wine bottles I have several colors um, but these ones are really dark and this is a beautiful day shade of pink it's similar to the benefit and I like the smell and taste of it. Mm -mm. You don't even need to apply it too much. Um, the lip tint kind of just seeps in. Give it a minute and you'll see. Oh, it tastes really good. Um, and it's a shade of pink. But if you like to go in the orange shades, then I love the Cha Cha tint from Benefit. Maybe we can just mix it. I also love mixing my lip colors. I think Okay, so now we're going to go into So this is like a nice stung lip. Now what I'm going to do is also remove a bit of these of the blush because I had put on some blush before this. Yeah. So I recently got um the Huda Beauty pink edition which I was longing to get and one of my favorite colors is this shade called Gossip Girl. It is a super pretty color. Okay so here it is. I love 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 this shade and if you want to lighten it um, another shade that I really like is this MAC Mocha shade, I think you can even mix it to and make it a little deeper and less pop. I can do a lot of lipstick tricks like this but it's basically all about mixing your shades and having fun with it. Okay, the most important thing for me is to finish my look with my brows. Um, I absolutely love this benefit brow mascara it's great because it keeps your brows in place once you comb your brows it's not going to move so uh, and when, when we're shooting usually we have a lot of like the blower fan and all these things coming in our way so i all i think i, I have very i have very defined and thick brows so i don't fill it in with any color but i use this brown mascara uh, brow mascara to really keep it in place and brush it up yeah so always end it with brows on fleek. So that was my super easy, super fun everyday makeup tutorial. If you like this video, then do like, share, subscribe and comment on Pink Villa.